When Meghan Markle first joined the royal family in 2018, many people hoped that she would become close with Kate Middleton. However, reality turned out to be a bit different. Meghan Markle and Kate Middleton did not instantly become best friends. In fact, according to certain insiders, they might have even been feuding with one another. But it looks like things are changing quickly nowadays and, if recent reports are to be believed, Meghan Markle and Kate Middleton's relationship is improving thanks to this one commonality that they can bond over. Let's take a look at what we know about their relationship below. Meghan Markle and Kate Middleton are quite different from each other. It turns out that the reason why Meghan Markle and Kate Middleton didn't become best friends right away is simply that they are different from each other. Sure, they are both close in age and considered commoners who married into royalty, but the similarities might have ended there. Kate Middleton grew up in a very wealthy English household. Her parents were successful business owners who sent her and her siblings to some of the most prestigious schools in the country. Kate essentially made herself a part of the upper echelon of society since she was a child. Meanwhile, Meghan Markle grew up in a biracial American family in California with divorced parents. She did attend a private school because her father won the lottery, but her upbringing was a lot more average than Kate Middleton's. Meghan and Kate's personalities are quite different as well. Since she was an actress in Hollywood, Meghan is noticeably very bubbly and outgoing. This is a stark contrast to Kate, who is more introverted and closed off. Meghan Markle and Kate Middleton were reportedly feuding with each other. Their differences meant that they did not always see things eye to eye. Ever since Meghan joined the royal family, there were often reports that she and Kate were not getting along very well. In November 2018, the British tabloids picked up on a story that Meghan allegedly made Kate cry while they were preparing for Meghan's wedding. At another time, there were rumors that Kate also yelled at Meghan over issues concerning staff members. The relationship between the two women reportedly got so bad that some people claimed it was the reason why Meghan and Prince Harry decided to move out of Kensington Palace, where they were living with Kate and Prince William, and into a countryside town outside of London. However, it's worth noting that these are merely rumors and no one reputable has ever confirmed them. Even if Meghan and Kate are not actually feuding, though, many fans still believe that they are not exactly best buds. Meghan Markle and Kate Middleton seem to be bonding over motherhood. It seems that the tide has been turning in the royal household recently when Meghan Markle became a mother. She gave birth to son Archie Harrison in early May and has been on maternity leave since then. This joyous occasion reportedly is helping Meghan and Kate, who has three children of her own, become closer than ever. Royal experts noted that the two of them looked especially comfortable with each other at the recent Trooping the Color Parade to celebrate Queen Elizabeth's birthday, Meghan's first public appearance since giving birth. Everybody was smiling and looked happy, journalist Emma Forbes said. It was a real moment of continuity. Meghan was chatting to the Duchess of Cambridge, and they were getting on well, Joe Little from the magazine Majesty pointed out. Fox News reported that Meghan's next public appearance could be at Wimbledon. She went with Kate last year, so if they are seen together again, it could help to put the feuding rumors to rest once and for all.